at all those people taking photos of the Pope with their cell phones. They're all doing something so fundamentally wrong and they don't even know it. Which if is... you're taking a photo this way, you're not getting the whole picture unless the image you're trying to capture is very tall and narrow. Instead, turn your phone this way. Oh my God, it's called no way. landscape mode. Oh Here's God. a photo of the Pope taken the wrong way. And now the right way. Isn't that much better? But aren't you taking a picture of the Pope, not everyone else? You're capturing what you want to capture. Doing it landscape doesn't really add much anything else. Just other people taking pictures. The picture is of the Pope. Not everyone else. Now a banana. Yep, you're peeling it all wrong. Oh no. Let this monkey show you how it should be done. Notice how he's holding it upside down. You don't open it from this end because sometimes it's not ripe enough and it's like you mess it. I'm gonna show you the monkey style way to open it. Go on then. Take this end, right? Uh huh. You pinch the top. Wink. And then. Ah, Whoa. smart. Wow. Look at that. We've got plenty of smart. other things you're probably doing wrong every day of your life. Take tin foil and plastic wrap. You know how hard it is to keep the roll inside when you do this. Well, here he is pulled the that too solution. Hard. Each one of these packages comes with a neat little secret. You push in these tabs on both sides, and voila. Oh. The roll See stays how much careful place. he pulled that out. You can though. rip away. Man. And how about peeling hard-boiled eggs? Lifestyle expert Erica Katz shows us a simple trick. Just put an egg in a glass, fill it with just a little bit of water, then cover the glass and shake it really, really well. You're not going to believe what happens next. The Why add water? comes right off. Oh. Look at that. That's Isn't good. That incredible. Show me what eggs. about those annoying little packets of medication? You can get a headache just trying to open them if you scissors. don't have scissors. Oh. Oh. Try to rip it. Surely there's like a tab there. Don't use your teeth. Sure. That. that was my next option. Here's how you do it. You fold them back like this, and that tiny slit is the beginning of your oh. tear, making it super easy to rip open even without scissors. So you're just following and how the instructions. About ice cream. Are your kids always asking you to scoop the ice cream because it's hard as a rock? Put it in the microwave. Well, if you keep your ice cream in the freezer in a Ziploc, it's going to keep it Ooh. perfectly scoopable. I don't have ice cream to try that. I kind of want to try that a little bit. I had a Ben Jerry's last night. I just whack in the microwave. Say I've had like a Ben Jerry's pot. Whack in the microwave for 10, 15 seconds. It's done. It's perfect. It's not completely melted. It's still frozen. It's just a little bit softer. It's so much better. Just use the microwave 15 seconds. But of all, not bad tips. Obviously, some of them actually will use. The uh, cling film one. I think I will use that, actually. That's quite helpful. I never knew I never knew they had little tabs on the sides of them. But just calling them out here. But this guy pulled it way too hard. He pulled it. So obviously, it's going to come out. And then when he put the tabs in, look how carefully he pulled it out. So that one's a bit, bit bullshit.